everyone, it's Tara. I just wanted to show you a altered cigar box that I did for uh, a friend of mine. Um, her son, it's his first year playing football, um, so he's eight years old, and she wanted me to create a box that she can keep like all the, you know, little memorabilia from his, his year um, playing football. Um, so I jumped at the challenge because usually when I do cigar boxes they're girly and you know flowers and lace and all that stuff but um, I had so much fun making this actually my sons uh, my twin boys they play football also so when they saw me making this they were like oh you gotta make me one so of course you know now I gotta I gotta make one for them but I had a lot of fun making this um, the paper that I used was this uh, Mambi kit that I picked up at Michael. It's actually made by me and my me and my big ideas. I said Mambi. I guess that's what that stands for, right? <laughs> um, so anyway, this was one of their scrapbook kits, um, and I didn't want to buy like a whole pad of paper for um, just for this um, this book because it, I found that all the papers had um, all of the sports, and all I really wanted was football. So anyway, this worked out good, and I got. All of these pieces in here. Actually, let me show you the back. So I got all of these pieces in here. It was $9.99. I used my coupon. Um, so it was like five bucks. And I, I got a ton of papers left. So I got all those papers and um, all of those embellishments. This is chipboard. So a sticker sheet, um, some 3D embellishments, and also. Anyway, that worked out good. Um, and then also I also purchased a button pack, a craft button, and this was also for Michael. So the, the button pack looked like this, if you're interested in getting it. And I got that again at Michael's, and this is what I have left, just a couple little um, pieces here. But anyway, um, yeah. So this is what I did. I painted the cigar box red and added the paper to the top and this is one of those chipboard pieces and I added um, some of the grass paper onto that and sanded it down and all like that and this is one of the buttons there we go so that's one of the buttons just added that in the middle of the the P for MVP and this is another one of the buttons I just cut the shank off of it and um, his team colors are black, white, and gold. So I got out my gold leafing pen and just went around the top of the uh, helmet with the gold. And I left it um, blank because uh, she can add his number there to the helmet. Or she can just tell me what the number is and I'll, you know, I'll add it in there for her. Um, here is a, um, this is one of the Sizzix dies, the frame die. And um, I left it open here so she can slide a photo in. And I don't know if you can tell, but again, I went over the frame with the gold leafing pen. I don't know if the camera's picking it up, but I did. Um, and then here's another one of those buttons from that pack. And then a sticker from the collection. So that's the top of the, the box. And then all around the side... I mod podged this uh, this uh, it was the grass paper and then I used my Martha Stewart punch this grass punch which I was so thrilled because I've had this punch forever and I don't think I've ever used it on anything but how perfect was this this was like perfect for that so I used the um, the pieces and mod podged it all the way around and I thought that gave it a really cool effect. So that's what I did there. And then here on the, oh, the tags are falling out. Okay, so then here on the inside, um, again, I used that grass paper. And I actually did this part first before I got the idea for the outside. But um, I did the same thing for the inside with the punch and did that all the way around the box so it looks like the field and I thought that was really cute and I just added one of the 
Um, this is one of the 3D stickers that came in the collection, the football. And so I'll show you the top here. So for the top of the box. There we go. Um, I added another one of the stickers, the all-star sticker and little football here and then in the corners I don't know if you can tell but these are little um, gold stickers well that's it's like these and I added those in all four corners and then I created a little um, accordion um, pocket here and I used vellum envelopes for that and some black cardstock for the the top and then just covered it with the pattern paper and then I went around the whole thing with the gold leaf the gold leafing pen again so that's what I did there and um, since she said you know she wanted to keep like memorabilia and stuff I figured I'd make a little thing for her to keep pictures um, and I love these little sayings that came in that sticker pack so we got practice makes perfect and then th this um, paper here is die cuts with a view. It's like some of their glitter paper from I don't know what collection, but I had that. And then this one says we are number one. Add a little football there. Oops. And then this one says go fight win. So. She can add photos. I put stickers on the back too. So she can add photos there of her son, or um, she can actually put two of the tags in one pocket and just save, like, you know, receipts or whatever, whatever kind of memorabilia she wants to save. So I thought that was fun. I had so much fun making this. Um, it's very um, different from the normal cigar boxes that we see. Um, and as I was making this, I must say, I was thinking of you, Shante, because I know you said your son plays football and all. And um, so hopefully you'll make something like this for him because this was really fun. Um, and yeah, so so that's the box. And I will be giving this to her this weekend. So seeing all my junk. Let me turn the camera down. <laughs> So anyway, so thanks for watching guys and let me know what you think. Bye.